There he is. Look, good Greeks. It's Homer. Yes, it is I, Homer, triple threat, both epic poet and blind guy. What's the third threat? It is I, Homer, double threat. I today gather all of Greek's best warriors, Agamemnon of Mycenae, Menelaus of Sparta, oh, of, of Ithaca, Ajax of Telamon, and Locris. Yeah. And of course, Douglas of Douglasville. Oh yeah. Together to make an announcement. Well, what is it, old man? Get to the point. Show some respect, Douglas. This man is the world's very first Times best-selling author. Yeah, Douglas. Show some respect. Since I'm writing a story about your exploits in the Battle of Troy, I've bequeathed each of you warriors epithets. Wow, those are nicknames, right? Like wide-seeing Zeus or gray-eyed Athena. Exactly. So announce yourselves to me, one by one, and I shall tell you the name that will mark your place in history. Oh, me first. I am Agamemnon, king of my city and leader of the Greeks. You are wide ruling. Agamemnon. That makes so much sense. And, 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 and I'm his brother, leader of the Spartans, Menelaus. I call you red-haired Menelaus. Most people would call it Auburn. It's red. You are a ginger. You're blind. Enough. I am Odysseus, king of Ithaca. Oh, yes. Poor, long-suffering Odysseus. Wait a minute, I, I haven't suffered anything yet. He would, yet. I'm Ajax. Which Ajax? There are two of you. I'm the Telamonian one. You shall be Ajax the Greater. Awesome. Well, what about me? I'm the Locrian Ajax. Ajax the Lesser. I should have seen it coming, but it still hurts. Okay, me next. I'm Douglas, King of Douglasville. I know who you are. And I've named you Big Dick Douglas. <gasps> oh no, according to Greek cultural values of male beauty, big dicks are atrocious. Why would you do this to me, Homer? Why would you name me Big Dick Douglas? It just felt right. You've never even seen my dick. I've never seen anything. My dick is small. It's small, small, I say. A teensy, tiny, elegant little pecker. Listen up. Big Dick Douglas, this is my epic poem, and your dick is however long I say it is, and I say you're packing an enormous wang. Well then, I'll sue you for slander. Ahem, <clears throat> uh, in print, it's libel. This story is oral. That's what she said to Big Dick Douglas, am I right? Uh -huh. <laughs> Gods, I can't let the world think I have a massive schlong. Well, if it really bothers you, I could write you out of the story completely. But then no one will know how bravely that I, Douglas of Douglasville, battled the Trojans for ten long years. It's either that or be passed down through history as Big Dick Douglas. Yes, wh what would your descendants think? The shame of being related to a man with a big, old vagina miner. Fine, fine. Erase me from history. I swear on my life and my honor, the world will never know the name Big Dick Douglas. <laughs>